All right, welcome to uh, Flipping Tables with the OMG Hour. And uh, today we're going to flip tables with a little game we picked up down at PAX East. It is a Canadian-based game made by a Canadian company called Newfoundland Jam. It is a fun two-to-four player uh, jam-making game. Jam-making. It's all about the making the jam. Making of the jam. I mean, who doesn't want to make jam? Basic rules of this game, you have both, uh, you, you have recipe cards, which you lay out on the table and you can choose from, and in order to make these recipes, you need the items that are on the bottom of the card, which are what Tico is these holding These are the in, so ingredient cards? Different types of ingredients, we have blueberries, we have a jam burglar, uh, we'll have better images for you here, yes. yeah, the lighting isn't quite right. Rhubarb. And uh, when you get those particular ingredients, kind of like, you know, like gin rummy, that sort of thing. Yeah. You're getting, trying to get straights and the and cards that you will need to win. And you get this many points. So uh, right down here, five points. Yes, you'll claim that recipe off the board yeah. and you'll get five points. And first to 11 points 11 wins. 11 points wins. Now, here's the thing. Chico and I have played this now a couple of times and we are tied. Yes. So we are going to play this game for you right now. And this is the tiebreaker. This it's a is a grudge match. It's our grudge match between the two of us. Uh, we played a game with the base game, uh, and then they released a, I guess, a DLC. Well, they, Could you a, call it a DLC? A DLC. <laughs> so there is a regular edition of this game, and then this is the deluxe edition, which comes with this fancy magnetic box, which I absolutely love. Love magnetic boxes. Um, and it has 35 additional cards. So we tried it with the, with those cards and without. I won with the cards in the pack. Tico won without them. I found without them, it was a longer. It seemed to be a longer game for some reason. Um, yeah, it's, well, I think it's because there was more stuff on the table, so we were actually able to get more cards out. Whereas when we played with the extra cards, I think we spent more time drawing up to that. But they were they're higher value cards um, in the in the. Well, the yeah, cards. I'm not quite sure. Really, I couldn't quite pinpoint the difference, but uh, we're going to play with the extra cards in it here, and uh, you can join us for a game of Newfoundland Jam. All right, so we're going to start off uh, with dealing out the play area of Newfoundland Jam. All right. And Tico, why don't you explain what you're doing as you do that? All right, so the first thing we've done, actually, there's two, two cards in the deck called Blowing a Gale. Yeah. These, so these cards come out. Yes, before we they come up. up beforehand because you don't want to have these drawn into your hand. So these these are um, instant action cards that once we put them back in the deck, um, they can affect the gameplay. So we pull these out for now. So pull these out of the deck. All right. We will now assign also the first player token. And you you totally got me. So tell, explain yes. to the audience how you right. determine this. So this is determined. The last person to have called somebody a juice arse yes. gets the first player token. Now, I remembered that from last time. <laughs> He called me a juice arse just before we started. Just before we game. started. So make sure I get that advantage. So I will now be the so first. First player. Tico. First player. All right. Then we are going to take the ingredients cards, which we have already shuffled up, and we get five each. So we will deal five face down each of the ingredient cards. And then we will create our play area with the ingredients cards. And this is a four across of the ingredients cards. And then we basically, we've got the little deck there, and we've got a little discard area there. Same thing we do with the recipe cards. So we've got those nicely shuffled up. We've got some blueberry jam out there, some peach jam, some partridge berry jam, and canned moose. The canned moose. Canned moose. All right, and then these cards here will also go here with the discard. Um, so I will be going first. Well, now um, we put these in. Oh, yeah. These get shuffled into that deck now. These now will get shuffled into this deck. So the one gale cards do get added into the deck now that that is gone out. Um, if they're drawn at any point, it's an immediate action. So I have put them in here now. Thank you for reminding me. Otherwise, they would have sat there. We would have looked really silly for not having put them back in. So I was excited about being first to go. I think I think you just wanted to get going. Yeah. So, all right. So there we go. Are you so, ready to lose? Uh, yeah. I'm, all, I'm Mr. Second Place. That is what I... I do constantly. So let's see what we got here. All right, so I'm, I'm going first. So we have a blueberry jam, we have a peach jam, a partridge berry jam, jam. and of course canned moose. Because canned moose, Canadian staple. And the, each one of these are there's different variations as well. So this is the best kind of canned moose, so it has worth seven points. And you have a generic partridge berry, which is only worth four points. And the big jib, which must be a Excellent. Newfoundland thing, uh, is worth four points as well. So the different variations of different types of jams. You could get peach jam that's worth more points. 
So the first thing I'm going to do is I am going to, I have to burn a card basically from, uh, what do we call this? This is the pantry. The pantry. So I'm going to burn a card. This is the recipe book. This is the pantry. Right. So I am going to, I'm going to get rid of the bake apple. Why would you want to get rid of baked apple? Come on. No, no. Bake apple. Come on. Bake apple. And then we replace that with the top card from the deck. Now I have the option now of drawing a card and replacing it with one from my hand. And I'm going to actually... So you can take from the pantry. I can take from the pantry. Or you can unpack the groceries. Unpack the groceries, which is two cards, two but cards. blind. Yes. So I'm actually going to take from the pantry. I'm going to grab this empty jar, which you need to... He's taking an empty jar. Which you need that to, to make a lot of jam. Otherwise, you just got your hands full of jam without nothing to put it in. And just, then, I mean, that's how... You put it on the bread with some peanut butter. That's a weird way to eat jam. So I'm replacing it with, a with bake. another bake apple. And now Good. Um, I Good. do not have anything I can actually purchase from the recipes right now. So I'm going to pass the friggin' jam I, to you, sir. I if I've got I don't have much to play with at the moment, to be honest with you. So um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to unpack the groceries. All right. I have a couple of cards here. Um, still don't have much to play with. So. Um, Oh, I didn't replace from the pantry. You had to do that oh, first. Oh, no. All right, so let's... let's uh, so I'll do that now. Um, get rid of that bake apple. I'm going to get rid of that bake apple again. Sure, why not? Bring out a peach. Peach. Oh, that was not a good thing mm, to take out. Peach. I'm going to pass the friggin' jam back pass to you. Pass the friggin' jam back to me. Yeah. It, it's actually called the friggin' jam. That's um, It says that in the rules. Pass the friggin' jam. All right, so I'm actually going to take the, the biffer boffers. Of course. Oh, sorry. No, I've got to clear one first. I'm going to clear the... The Jam Rambler, and replace with another peach. We've got two peaches out two there. Two peaches. All right. I am now going to take the Biffer Boffer into my hand and replace it with um, uh, we'll replace it with a strawberry. Now, I actually now, I have a Partridge Berry. Oh. I have an Empty Jam. And, of course, the Biffer Boffer that I just picked up. So you're making Partridge Berry fan I'm jam. making generic Partridge Berry Jam. So that is mine. And now I am up. Four points to none. And these here will all now get put into the discard. And we will draw a new recipe. Okay. Oop. And it is more... More canned mousse. More canned mousse. Although, that's just generic canned mousse. It is. It's not as good as the high-end stuff. So, And I'm passing the freaking jam to uh, you, sir. Well, well, well. Isn't that just peachy? Peachy. Hey, nice. <laughs> you see what I did there? I, did you do it on purpose? Uh, kind of. But I won't tell. I won't tell anyone. Um, I I don't even know what to do, Tico. Four, five, six, seven. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna unpack. You're the gonna motion. safely go go. What? This? Wait, wait, wait! I have to replace oh, yep. before I look at the cards. Yes. I might as well replace this peach. This peach with with oh, oh a jam store coupon, which can be used in place of any fruit. In yes. a recipe. So that is basically a wild fruit card, uh, which is which is nice. And, 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 and of course, there is literally nothing on the board I can make. None. Nothing. Yes, I so know. So I will, I will also, I'm going to do... Oh, this is... And I know you're being very careful not to hit that 10 card limit. Cause... So here's what happens. If you if you get 10 cards in your hand... You get jammed uh, and up. And I, I have 9 cards. You get jammed up if you have 10. And you have to lay all your cards out on the table... And it now becomes a pantry that Tico can play out of. Yeah, so and I can to. also look and see what you're going for. Yeah. The other option you have if you get jammed up is to discard your entire hand and draw five new cards. Which isn't a bad idea sometimes at this point. It's, sometimes it's not. Uh, when you have those ten cards, if you're jammed up, sometimes rather than giving me that free information, it might make sense. Uh, anyway, here's your freaking jam. Here's my freaking jam. All right. Um, all right, let's uh, see. What am I going to do here? What am I going to do here? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to clear this. Oh, um, okay. You're I'm not... just I'm gonna clear. Really? It. Yeah. Um, and then I'm gonna so this this was a jam store coupon. Yep. Which we explained can be used. In... You didn't want to take that. I into didn't your want hand? to take that because I only have two cards, so I don't have enough to do anything with, and then I'd just be sitting with it there. So I'm I've done it this way just to make sure you can't take it. Thanks. So I am now going to unpack the groceries and draw a couple of a uh, couple of ingredients, uh... and I can't make anything, so I'm passing you the. The friggin', the friggin' jam, sir. Yeah, thanks. 
Thanks. And you for can't that. use that jam jar. Uh, no, there you can't use. This is not. This is not a usable jam jar. That is. That is the one of the hard parts of this game is making sure you have a a, a receptacle for your. Uh, well, I am going to take the chance. I'm going to unpack the groceries. Nope. Wait, no. Nope. First, I have to burn a car. Let's get rid of this globber popper. Oh, I was holding globber off. I needed. Popper. I needed that globber no, popper. Didn't. No, you didn't. There's some rhubarb instead. Ooh, strawberry rhubarb. You could, you could make some Yeah, nice. if we had. Now I'm going to unpack. And really, <clears throat> I've just got nothing but stuff I don't need. So you have eleven cards. I have eleven cards. So now I'm going to discard my entire hand. Okay. And draw and draw five more. Five new cards. Now I get a brand new hand. Yeah. And you are now in with, your uh, with your recipe phase. With nothing in it to do anything with. So here's your friggin' jam. I'm passing the friggin' jam back, eh? I uh, I think I think you're gonna win. That's all I'm just saying. Uh, well, I mean, I this yeah. grudge match is not going well for me at all. Let's get rid of some of the strawberry <laughs> again. There's a lot of strawberry out there. And, oh, some more partridge berries. Why don't you make some more partridge berry stuff? Uh, well, there's no recipe out there that works that. So I'm going to uh, unpack the groceries again. And uh, we'll see what uh, what happens. And uh, I cannot... Uh, well, partridge berries are not going to do anybody any good. Uh, well, I mean, I used them here. That was, uh, how about another peach? That's that's two peaches. Uh, and there's a peach jam out on the board. There, so There is a peach jam. That is, that is the truth. You tell the truth. I do. But, I, you go, go, go. didn't I just do that? I got rid of the partridge Oh, did you? Berries. You did. I'm sorry. I was just making. Do you need us to rewind the video, and remember you? Let's remind go back you? to the tape. Go back. Yeah. <laughs> um, interesting. 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 Oh, that's that's actually promising. Uh oh. It's I not don't... just interesting. It's promising. Although. I didn't see nothing. Good. All Good. Right. Uh, all right, well let's uh, let's clear out one of these peaches just in case you're thinking of doing something with that, and we will replace. Well, maybe it. you want to do something with it. No, no, I'm good. Uh, and there's a jam rambler out there. I have uh, six cards in my hand, so I am safe to to do this and grab two more cards. Oh, and I did draw a jam burglar, which is an instant card, which I can play. Look at another player's hand and steal a card. What? So I will be looking at your hand, sir, what? and stealing one of your cards. Let's see, what do you got? Some strawberries, some blueberries, some biffer boffers, and uh, that's it? That's, that's, all that's it. That's all you got? You're not hiding anything good in there? Um, I'm telling. You know what? I'm taking one of your blueberries. Of course you are. Taking one of your blueberries and uh, passing you the frickin' jam. Well, nobody wants... A jam rambler? Nobody wants a rhubarb. Oh! <gasps> I've never understood rhubarb. How about a store Ooh. jam store coupon? That's not bad. I've never understood rhubarb. Like it to me, it doesn't it doesn't taste good. I don't like rhubarb. Like I, I never. I have. know people have made. You know, I think I made pie. myself. I made myself sick of rhubarb because when I was a kid, my parents had a rhubarb patch in the backyard. Just ate it. And we would go back there and just eat it. And I probably got so tired of eating rhubarb that I just don't like it anymore. Yeah, I don't know. I've never seen. Um, I did I do anything? I didn't pick up anything. No, no I just did, did that. I'm just sitting here this. thinking, what do I want? What do I want? And I will go to the grocery store and get absolute garbage in my hand again. <laughs> this is ridiculous, Tico. Uh, all right. Um, let's again, let's get rid of that coupon. Why wouldn't you just take it? It could be anything you want. Because it doesn't... It, it it doesn't... Could, you... Oh, you took a blueberry. That could literally be a blueberry if you've got sugar and a and a jar. And I don't understand. It, well, listen, not everybody has to understand everything that everybody does. Um, I am going to take this jam rambler that uh, you know you keep talking smack about, and I'm going to replace it with the blueberry that you were so excited about. <laughs> and now I will pass you the freaking jam, sir. Oh, goodness! Again, nobody likes rhubarb. You know, eventually we're going to get a whole bunch of hate mail from the rhubarb <laughs> folks. I'm sure that there is like a, you know, the rhubarb defense group or something like I've that. I've got eight cards in my hand. If I go to the grocery store, I will have ten. Yeah, that was my problem too. That's... Unless I get something that actually <clears throat> does me good, which is probably unlikely. Yeah. Uh, so let's have a look. Oh, I got... 
I got blowing a gale. Ooh. I got blowing a gale. So we have to play this immediately. Yep. And then you'll, you'll replace redraw. the entire pantry or recipe book. Ooh. Okay. So this okay. Can, this is an interesting. I am taking this entire recipe what? book. But I've been I've been working towards those. And I'm discarding it. And we are replacing it with four new recipes. You know, we've got partridge berry jam, rainbow jam, par another partridge berry jam, and, and another rainbow jam. Who shuffled these? Uh, you did, then I did. They've been shuffled. They have definitely. And um, I, you have to play these immediately. Uh, you don't have to play those immediately. Oh, those, you don't. Those are not. They don't have. You to had be. to. Play, you said you did. I said you can play it immediately. Oh, you don't have to. Well, then I'm going to look through the cards in the garbage bin and draw one. <gasps> There's so much rhubarb in there. <laughs> what four different fruits of any kind is all you need to build this? Yep. Four different now or uh, five or five. Um, I mean, I guess the, here's the question: What is a fruit and what's not a fruit? Well, a like jam ramblers, are they a fruit? No, those are, that's a utensil. That's a utensil. That's a utensil. Um, I would not consider a moose to be a fruit. No, fruit, moose is not a fruit. Um, and obviously sugar and all that stuff. So anything that would be, you know, you would probably say would be a fruit. Well, I am going to look through this card. And I still get another card because of the blowing. Yes. So I should probably draw that so I know what I've got. Excellent. Excellent. This is, oh, yeah, this is yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna grab the, do I have to tell you what I'm taking? I have no idea. Uh, yes, you do. And draw one, it says. So I drew one. Yeah. Do I, why do I have to tell you what I, I got? Because I want to know. Well, too bad. So that actually leaves me with something I can do. Alright, good, because you've got like 18 cards. Yeah, exactly. So I'm gonna go with blueberries. Yeah. Strawberries. Yeah, that's a fruit. Peach. Nope, not a fruit. All right, it's a fruit. Rhubarb. Mm. Okay. Listen. I'll give it to you. Listen. I'm going to make some rainbow jam with four different types of fruit. That gives me three points, finally. You're on the board. I'm going to replace that with some canned mousse. Some canned mousse. Good. Not, I, finally have, <clears throat> I finally have some points on the table. Well, I am happy for you. Not really. Um, I am going to, I'm going to do this. I'm going to draw two. I oh, I'm sorry. I forgot to uh, get rid of the strawberry first. Fair. And Throw then that out. the globble hoover. Globble bobber? The globble bobber. Globber bobber. Glob it's like a mixing plus a you know, cutter plus. And that does change what I'm doing. I'm taking <sighs> that now and dropping a strawberry. Are you going to make some canned mousse? Uh, I am not making any canned mousse actually. And I am not making anything at this particular stage. Well, nobody needs strawberries right now, so let's get rid of one of those. What? Some bake apple. Ooh. That doesn't help anyone either. Or does it? No. I don't know. Do I need? I don't, what do I need all these cards for? Holy cow! I've got so many cards in my hand that I don't need. All right, two more. Yep. Um, oh, I get to play this? I get to look at your hand and steal <clears throat> a card. Let me see your hand. <laughs> the other hand. Um, okay. I'm going to take that moose. I was, I was, I'm taking the moose. I was saving that I'm moose. I'm taking the moose. I was saving that moose. All right, fine. Uh, how many cards you got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, nuts. How many do you have? I have eight, I have seven. Because I had eight. You had eight. I had it. It actually helps me. Uh, I'm going to get rid of this random strawberry that everybody seems to hate so much. Oh. Ooh, well. That's out there now. Uh, I am going to draw two. Leaving you with nine cards. Unless nine. you can make some partridge berry jam. Uh, I make no jam today. No jam for you. No jam for me. No jam for you. No. Right, what do I do? What do I do, Tico? Well, you burn one of these cards first. Yes. Let's burn this one. 
I like that we're burning all of the. Like, we don't want to pick up that card, but we we don't want to. Some can moose or some moose meat there for you. Yeah. Is, that's that's some good moose meat. It's uh, fresh. It's fresh. Fresh moose meat. Fresh off the front mm. lawn. Yeah. Listen. Listen. Um. I'm gonna go for two. That puts you at ten. Maybe it doesn't. It, yeah, it, it does. does. One, My two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Um, you are jammed up, sir. I am completely jammed up with nothing to do. So I'm getting rid of my hand because I'm not going to let you play from it. Man, that's just rude. One, two, three, four, five cards. I am starting again. This is, this this is, is Sean just, in the kitchen. This is seriously... I, I quit. You can't just quit. I can't. Oh, it's not no. in the rules? No. I can just see you in the kitchen making jam. Just like... Just covered with all sorts of different kinds of jams. It's not working. It's not working. Giving up. Oh, uh, seriously, I have like nothing to go on here. No. Right, I think I passing the freaking jam. I think the first time we played, I just got really lucky. Yes, I think that I'm strategizing in the in the proper way. So I've got nine cards. So I'm actually. I'm gonna... This this game is supposed to take twenty minutes. Twenty <laughs> minutes, it says. An empty can. An empty can. If only you had a biffer buffer. I'm taking the empty can. Oh, because I know why. Because now you can make canned moose. <clears throat> now I can almost make canned moose. Oh, if only I didn't steal that clobber bobber from you. All right. Uh, and how many do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, I don't have. Yeah, we're good. I think you kind of muffled how many you had there. I have, just trying to hide that you have ten. I just couldn't count that high. I have nine. You couldn't count to ten. I, I got confused. Wow. With my counting. I have nine. He can't count to ten. You, you heard it here first. I he can was... if I'm allowed to take my socks off. No. All right. No, then. you really can't. Um. Well, you know what? I will take that canned moose. And replace it with a biffer buffer. A biffer buffer. That's interesting. Uh, but interestingly enough, I was supposed to get rid of something first. So let's do that too. Right. A clobber bobber. The clobber bobber. Um, and yeah, there you go. And uh, you're, the you're, under your, you're under your hand count. Up. I am way under my limit here. All right. Well, let us clear the clobber bobber. And replace it with a partridge berry. berry. Interesting, interesting. Very interesting. interesting. All right. You realize if you can make that partridge berry, you win. I know. I'm working on it. Oh, well, hey, now I know what he's getting. I'm working on I'm it. Work uh, he's uh, working on it. Now I know what to stop him from doing. All right. So I have an ungodly amount of cards. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. <gasps> Are you going to open your hand up? Or oh. Uh, of course not. He's... <laughs> Four, five he's, new cards. He's pulling a me. Yeah, we're not letting anybody in on this. And let's see. Let's see what I can get to. Uh, Resetting his Partridge Berry Jam ooh, streak. Interesting. Okay. Um, I'm going to play the Jam Burglar. Uh, draw a recipe card and place it face down in your play area. Only you may view or claim this recipe. So... So yeah, only only Tico knows what this recipe is now, oh, and only he can make oh, that recipe. Interesting, interesting. All right, well, hang on. So everybody else knows. Are they? Are you sure? No. Maybe you went too fast. I probably did, but uh, we'll see at the, the end, and then I'll have to. Here, let me have a, a look at it, and I'll tell you. Yeah, I think we're good. Okay. I think we're good. Uh, and uh, I'm gonna pass the freaking jam to you, sir. All right. All right. All right. Uh... Yeah, listen, <coughs> listen, here's how things work. We take these blueberries and we get rid of them because they're going bad. They've been in there a while, stinking up the pantry. We're going to add some peaches. Interesting. Peaches. I like peaches. Peaches are good. Maybe I want the peaches. peaches. Maybe that's, I would prefer that you put more peaches down. Listen, I want to go to the grocery store. Unpacking the grocery You've already been. It's just this a big pile of groceries at the back of your car. Yeah, and apparently, you know, whoever went to the grocery store for me just had no clue what I actually needed and bought me random stuff. Yeah, that's how my wife does groceries. Wow. 
Go for it. All right. Uh, I am also uh, going to, sorry, we're going to do this first. <gasps> Ooh, an empty the jar. jar. Um, you know, I got to go for that jar. You're taking the jar? I got to take what the jar. What are you taking a jar for? Uh, because I like jars. You like to collect jars? I like to collect the jars. You ever notice this rainbow jam doesn't even need a jar? No, I noticed that. This is really, that is truly that canned. Is, that is my kind of jam. Canned jam. Just take the jam, mix them all together, plop it on a piece of bread. Interesting. You get it all over you. That's, yeah, that's that's how I make jam. That's how I make jam. That, I'm sorry, we're going. Oh, passing the freaking Oh, here. okay, good, you're done. All right, well... Oh, I have seven cards. All right. Uh, too many peaches in no, the pantry? No, no, no. Don't get rid of the peaches. I'm going to replace it with another empty jar. Oh, those jars are helpful. Going to the store again. All right. Unpacking the groceries. Garbage. Just garbage, Tico. Who shuffled this deck? Seriously, who shuffled well, this deck? Well, I think deck? you did than I did. Oh, I think you shuffled like there's, them, and I mixed them back up in the battle. This order. is... There's got to be a way... You know, I wish there were more ways... To get the recipe, like remove recipes you don't want. Yeah. These stay out, and if if you never fill these, you're just stuck with them. Yeah. Unless we're missing some rule. We will look that up after. You know I think that we're good. We, there's got to be a way of replacing these things. All right. Um, let's get rid of the strawberry. Because you know strawberries. Blah. Another jam store card. Yes. Use in place of one fruit to complete a recipe. Uh, interesting. Now, would you consider a moose head to be fruit? You already said no. Interesting. Interesting. You, you, when it was benefiting me, you yeah, said it was not fruit. I know. So I have an empty jar. I have biffer boffers. I have a partridge berry. And I have a coupon for another partridge berry. So you're taking the jib, big jib? I'm taking the big jib. That's giving you nine points. Nine points. All right, new recipe card. A bake apple jam. Wait, wait, and now I'm going to pass. You got a bake apple jam out. Ooh. You are also only two points away from winning. Yes, that was my plan all along. I have no cards. <sighs> <clears throat> Look, I made two different kinds of partridge berry jam. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You really like that stuff. I am a big fan. It's no mayo cube, but you know. It's, <laughs> it's no mayo cube. Sugar. Ooh. Sucre. 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 From Prison Break. Oh, this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine cards. Ooh. I'm taking my chance and I'm going to go grocery shopping. Unpack those groceries. That does not help me. You're going to let me shop from your hand? or uh, you... No. Maybe I should. It would give me an extra thing to... Maybe, I have no cards. Like, so just, it's not... just for fun, let's do it. <clears throat> All right. Okay, so I'm putting my cards out. I'm putting all my cards out. These are now open for anyone to shop with. Shop for... Like, look at all this sugar. Look, so, I got way too much sugar. It looks like you're trying to make some diabetes, is what it looks like. <laughs> it really does. All right. Um, um, so I can't do anything with what I've got, so no. I will pass it to you. So now this is out as a pantry for you. Yes, until you are below 10 cards. Before, yeah, when I get back down to below 10 cards. So an interesting thing, if because you have one, you have 11 now, so you need to get two, get rid of two of those cards. Yes. And still be drawing. So if I take stuff from you right now, that actually helps you. It's true. So I'm going to, um, well, let's get rid of, let's get rid of uh, this jar and replace it with that jar. Now, when you take from me, you still have to replace, don't you? Like, it's, a, it's the same as you shopping from here. Yeah. So it doesn't help that, me. That is. Oh, well, you're going to the grocery store. I went to the grocery store. Um... And I'm going to play a jam burger, look through the cards in the garbage bin, and draw one. That's a big garbage bin. All right, let's uh, see here. Let's see what's, uh, what we're looking at here. Oh, I like that. That thing's, that thing's pretty cool. I like that one there. Interesting, interesting, interesting. I'm going to go with that one. 
And you're going to share with which, with the audience what you got? Uh, with the audience, sure. Uh, I got one of those. What is it? Tell me what it is. What is it? Yes. Yeah. She's going to be checking the comments to find out what that is. <laughs> Done? Uh, wait, I can make nothing. Okay. Well, this is interesting because, I mean, if I just keep taking from there, I'm just going to get more and more until I can make something. Yep. Oh, first let's replace the peach. Not the peach. Again, with the peach. Oh, with a partridge berry. Thank goodness berry. there's partridge berries out there. I am going to take these two cards and add <coughs> them to my open pantry. A peach and another bake apple. Oh. Right, well, so that got, is interesting. you got two bake apples. You're just missing a uh, I am all I'm missing rambler. is a jam rambler. Um... And there's nothing I can do, so I'll pass it back to you. I'm hoping for a jam rambler. You're hoping for a jam rambler, are you? Obviously. Yeah. I can good. say that now because you know exactly what yeah, I've got. Just, just... There's no hiding what I'm going for. Uh, I'm going to draw two cards. Intru I'm going to, I'm you going sure to... you could, first you're going to replace? I'm going to replace this jar. Well, nobody needs jars, especially for making peach. jam. More peaches. More peaches. If only we had peach jam out. Yeah, take two cards. That's can an you interesting. Make anything? I I can, but you're choosing not to. I uh, know I'm going to make it. Oh, what are you I'm, making? I'm going to use an empty jar. No. And I'm going to use this coupon for, for one piece of fruit uh, to make. Uh, I'm going to say peach. I'm going to use that for as a, as a peach. Okay. And I'm going to use that one also as a peach. Okay. Oh, you made peach jam. I made some peach jam. You got oh Tico. And that would be twelve points. You win. I win. I quit. You can't just quit. I just did. Don't flip the table. Flip the table. Overall thoughts of Newfoundland Jam. Uh, worst game ever, because obviously Listen, I lost. I am, according to the rule book here, I am the Grand Jam Champion of Newfoundland. Well, you're the Grand something champion, all right. So I don't think it's Jam, though. Yeah, so I was the big winner. Uh, that is the, in the grudge match. So, listen, I enjoyed this game. I think it's fun. But um, what I did find, and I mentioned it while we were playing, is I would like a way or more ways to actually get rid of recipes and replace the recipes because you could go a very long time and not get anything that you need for any of the recipes. Now, there, there are a couple of cards, like the, the Blowing the Gale, like wherever that card well, is. Well, it would be easier Listen, to find if you hadn't... If you hadn't done what you did, Tico. Won the game. If you yeah. hadn't won the game. So there's a Blowing the Gale card that allows you to either get rid of the entire pantry or get rid of the, blowing the recipe. Blowing the Gale. Blowing a Gale. Blowing a Gale. Um, I would like to see, there's only two of these in the whole deck. I'd like to see maybe more of them or perhaps Jam Burglars, which are action cards as well, that allow you to bring out more recipes or get rid of yeah. recipes you don't want on the table. Because if you think about it, if I know what you're going for, and I'm like, oh, I got a jam, you know, I got a jam burglar or a recipe burglar or whatever. I could get rid of the recipe he's going for, which totally yeah, messes you up. It does. And, uh, yeah, I think that that's the one thing that's sort of lacking in is, is a card to, to change that up. I mean, there's, we spent, um, you know, probably a few extra minutes longer than a regulation game would be because there was, there was cards out there that we just, we, we had nothing. We had we no were drawing, cards to go for. Nothing towards any of those. Um, and I would like to have an opportunity to like, okay, I need to clear that out or clear one of those out in order to, to draw some new ones. I think that's the, the one thing that I would say that I, I think that the game needs um, a slight change to. Other than that, I really actually had a lot of fun. It is a fun game. My favorite jam-based uh, card game. By far the best. By game. far. Yes. Um, it, it's, it's, a, it's a fun little game. I really enjoyed that. I love the Canadian content, the, the little... Nods towards the Canadiana there, the the canned moose. Canned moose. Yeah, I mean everybody you likes just, canned moose. You right? just completely, uh, you just oh yeah, go ahead. Here, let's just put it put it away, Sean. Put the whole thing away. No, no. Are you done? So that is Newfoundland Jam, and that is from the same makers as Drinking Quest. I'm looking for the name here. It's Jason Anarchy Games. Uh, it was actually developed by a gentleman in Toronto. Um, he probably has family in Newfoundland. Well, that's where it comes from. But uh, that is Newfoundland Jam. Those are our thoughts, and that is our game through gameplay. 
and I'm done because I lost, so take off. That was such a mess.